I'm here now with Oscar-nominated actor Jake Gyllenhaal. He is starring with Hugh Jackman in a heart-pounding thriller that I had to stay up way too late last night to watch. It's called Prisoners. He plays the lead detective assigned to find two missing little girls. Here he is, closing in on an elusive suspect, questioning him about shopping for some clothes. The crime to shop there? I can't afford to buy suits from Brooks Brothers. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no. Yeah, man, you bought children's clothes. Did I? Must have been in a hurry. Mm -hmm. do, you have, do you have children? No. I don't. Jeff. Yeah. Okay. It is so disturbing, and we want to welcome you. You do a terrific job. Thanks. I like that introduction. It's so disturbing. It is, it, it, and welcome. <laughs> uh. In the greatest way possible. Like any psychological thriller, it, it gets you at the start, and the content for a parent is is the unthinkable. Mm. You know, two little girls go missing. You are an uncle in yeah. real life, a yes. godfather in real life to the late Heath Ledger's little girl. Yeah. How did this resonate for you as an actor? Well, I mean, I think it's actually a heroic story, ultimately. I mean, I think that there's a lot to be said about the subject matter and what starts the story and, and, and ends up, you know, finishing it. But at the end, throughout it, it's about a hero, you know, really a father who goes to, you know, takes the law into his own hands. And then also I think about it's questions about what being a man is, what being a father is, you know, what doing the right thing is. There's so many fascinating questions within this and an amazing whodunit in the middle of all of it. And by the way, I have to say thank you for staying up so late to watch it. I You're know welcome. that you have a job to do. And, yeah, no, I, back to uh, school A lot of night, responsibilities, night, so. I, you know, it's always a better conversation when you see it, and I, I, I truly couldn't stop watching it. Um, and, and the photography is so beautiful oh and stirring. God, yeah. um, and yet it's dark, and uh, we saw some behind the scenes footage where yeah. there's also a lot of levity behind the scenes yes. that you provided, I understand. <laughs> Well, I was, you know, when you're working with Hugh Jackman and particularly our director too, who's just a wonderful man, you know, I think family is important to all of us. And like you said, I have children in my life who I love so much, but you know, they're great fathers, both the director and Hugh. And I think they do a wonderful job as well as the producers who make wonderful movies too about family that made The Blind Side and Dolphin yeah. Tale and all stuff. So I think that sense of family was always around on set. And I think that allowed for people to be themselves and you kind of, I, I would imagine, jokester. have to take a break when it's that deep, like just to kind of yeah, let loose a little yes. bit. Yes, I, I look at it like kind of like a slingshot. Like if you're gonna commit to something in a scene that's full of tension and is a little dark, it's nice to go all the way to the other side. Yeah. So you can kind of go as far as you can the other way. But yeah, it's always fun. I mean, look, I have an amazing job, so yeah. it's nice to have fun. And you are amazing at it. Uh, Hugh Jackman tweeted about you: not only a great actor, but a great mate. Tell me about working with <laughs> our friend Hugh Jackman. Man, it's it's just uh, it's frustrating how wonderful he is he's a really really good guy I, I, I you know I, when I, I've heard a lot I heard a lot about him before I worked with him how nice he was and all yeah. stuff and I was like really all true Let's see how nice this guy is it's really all true I, it's uh, like, I love hearing that I also loved seeing this 1991 from A&E biography we found this clip of you on a red carpet from your very first film no. 10 years old oh, take no. a look city slickers you were promoting on a red carpet I used to ride horses at Martha's Vineyard where I used to be, but not much anymore, because I'm sort of scared. <laughs> Can you still do that? <laughs> I take a lot of pride in preparing for characters, but uh, that clearly I was preparing very early on for Brokeback Mountain with that one. <laughs> Uh, look at that hat. Um, Amazing. Yeah, no, um, that was incredible. Uh, I actually remember that uh, vividly. Uh, when I come here all the time, it's it's hard to forget. Yeah. You guys are an incredible show and incredible people who work very hard. It's amazing to see everybody put the set together before I even walked on. Yeah. Everybody's working so fast and so hard. It's incredible. So it's hard to thank you. It's hard to forget. So yeah. even at whatever. Well, thank you. Ten years for, old for recognizing our incredible team and thank you for the great work that you do. Oh, thank really, you. Really, really appreciate so it. Everybody, do check out Prisoners. It will be in theaters this Friday.